arts and culture. Thompson Highway. Cree is the language of laughter, so I laugh all the time. And I like to share laughter. It's probably my favorite sound in the world, is human laughter. So I like to, to surround myself with the sound of human laughter. It makes me very happy. And I think ultimately it's because the reason why I like to make people laugh is that people are at their, are at their most beautiful when they laugh. People are at their, at their most beautiful when their teeth are exposed and their eyes are dancing. And I like to see that. Thompson Highway is a celebrated playwright, novelist, humorist, classical musician, and professor, originally from Barren Lands First Nation in northern Manitoba. A fluent Cree speaker, Thompson was the 11th of 12 children born to legendary caribou hunter Joe Highway and quilt maker extraordinaire Pelagy Highway. He received international acclaim for his now legendary play, The Res Sisters, in 1986, which was followed in 1989 by Dry Lips Ought to Move to Kapiskasing, the first Canadian play in history to receive an extended run at Toronto's Royal Alexandra Theatre. His novel, Kiss of the Fur Queen, was a fixture on the Canadian bestseller list for many weeks, and he's authored three children's books. Among his innumerable awards are the prestigious Order of Canada, three Dora Maver Moore Awards, and the Floyd S. Chalmers Canadian Play Award, as well as 10 honorary doctorates. Thompson says his work is deeply influenced by the love and joy of life inherent in his culture. That's where those plays come from. It comes from the impulse of laughter, it comes from the impulse of the people I love most, which is my mother and her sisters, and I write about the people I know best, and most of the people I know that were, who are close to me are funny people. I surround myself with funny people. If you don't laugh 50 times a day, you're not my friend. <laughs> <laughs>